Well, a warning now. Some people may find the following content in this next story disturbing. At least 16 people are dead after two gunmen stormed a maternity ward in Afghanistan. Mothers, newborns and nurses are among those killed in the Kabul attack. The same day a suicide bombing killed at least 24 people at a police officer's funeral in Nandagar province. Afghan President Ashraf Ghani has ordered a full offensive against the Taliban and other militant groups, ending a period of reduced conflict ahead of U.S. brokered peace talks that had been set to start later this year. Let's bring in CTV's Paul Workman. He's in London right now following this. So, Paul, walk us through what you know with regards to these latest attacks from Afghanistan's interior ministry. Well, certainly the attack in Kabul was just terrible, horrific. Um, unlike really a lot, anything we've really seen in that um, city, and there have been a lot of attacks. Afghans have suffered miserably over the last uh, many, many, many years. But this was extraordinary to go into a maternity hospital and start, start shooting randomly at mothers who are giving birth or about to give birth, at nurses. And at newborns, two newborns um, died, as far as we know. Mm -hmm. As you said, the government has now ordered an offensive to go after the Taliban and any other terrorist groups. This is before um, anybody has even taken responsibility for today's horrible attack inside uh, Kabul itself. There were other attacks in the countryside, but the president has decided tonight he must move. Yeah, horrifying situation out there. What does this mean, then? Paul, for the stability in the region, which has been quite fragile for so many years. What does it mean for the stability inside Afghanistan? Probably it has shaken and rattled any chances of getting a peace deal of any kind. Of course, the Afghan government has not been involved directly with the Taliban in negotiations. That's all happened with the United States at that level. But there was certainly some thought or some hope that it might develop into a possibility of peace talks later on. This seems to have scuttled that mm -hmm. for the time being anyway. It really is just a terrible, um, it's a terrible, hateful attack on so many innocent people. A maternity hospital, imagine that. And I think that will, um, that will probably revolt a lot of Afghanistan, uh, Afghans who will not be interested in, in dealing with the Taliban at all mm -hmm. until there's some sort of semblance of uh, normalcy in the country. Yeah, and as you say that, I guess that's the big question is or when there will be any sense of normalcy in that country. But as you say, just a devastating situation. There's so many innocent lives lost. All right, CTV's Paul Workman in London. Really appreciate the update on this, Paul. Thank you so much. Okay, thank you. You're welcome.